The Last of Us is clearly the worst. You mean the best show ever. That's right, it's ZN Noob Noob here to debate The Last of Us and whether or not the show is as good as or as bad as everyone is saying. It's the best thing ever! I don't think so. So, I guess we could go to some articles and kind of take a look at what people are talking about. I think the show took a, a little bit of time for people to catch on and whether or not they would actually like this show. From what I recall reading, there were articles saying something like from its debut to the second episode, it had the highest ratings jump ever yeah. that, that HBO's ever seen. So it went from something very low. It like jumped 22 to 25 percent. So that's what I said is people didn't catch on early and then they went back and started to watch it. Now, there were a couple of roadblock episodes, as they might call them. You mean them. the gay ones? You mean the ones that were taken from the video game? The gay video game. Well, what was it? The DLC? The well, one of them was the one. Other one was just made up. No, it was it was taken. It was still taken out of the game. Not right. really. Yeah, it was there. Uh, if you there's uh, letters that were written from uh, those two characters. Yeah, it's different though. Yeah, I mean they don't have a whole episode where they live. It's also in a like utopia. a totally different direct uh, tra uh, trajectory. Jesus. Yeah, it's it's a little bit different. They don't live in like this idyllic little town. They live in like a claustrophobic little. It's like crawling with infected. And I think that's one of the biggest complaints that people have in general is this was this was labeled as like a zombie horror movie. It's well, not really. There's it's not a not. lot of zombies. There's also the one big complaint I have is there's not a lot of traveling. I, they cover like thousands of miles a lot of on fast foot. traveling. Yes, there's a lot of fast traveling. You don't get that character development that you were looking for. They literally spent, what, an hour and 20 minutes on two characters that have zero relevance to the plot? That's the third episode. That, that I mean, yeah, that's fair. They really don't. It's a very self-contained episode, and it was one of the longest ones in the entire show. It was longer than the finale. Yes, and the finale was actually quite short, and it felt rushed, too. And, and I think that's part of the problem is people were saying, is this the best video game adaptation ever? It I mean, is. it was pretty cl Is it? Name one. Um... Yeah, exactly. No, I have one. I have one. You don't. I do. I do. Go it's, ahead. It's the one that's on Netflix that I always rant about. Resident oh. Evil. No. With Lance Reddick. Rest in peace. Oh, my God. Too soon. Yeah. Blesker. No. What's the one? Hashtag blessed. The League of Legends thing that I always say is so amazing. Uh, Arcane? Yes. That is easily way, 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 way mm. better. A, that's animated. It's amazing. It's the best thing I've ever... It's mm, one of the top meh. 10 shows I've ever seen ever. No. It is. You've never seen it, so you don't know. Well, top 10 is already irrelevant because you have Dragon Ball Z season one. Season that's two. not a video game. Season... Th yes, it is. It There's didn't a start lot. as a video game. It did not. That's the same as saying Spider-Man. Uh, all right. I'll give you that. No, this has to be a video game adaptation. League of Legends, Arcane is an adaptation first it, it's a video yeah. game first i'm gonna say last of us is better it's not i haven't seen arcane but i'm gonna say last of us is better it's not mm. i have many reasons really you think this is better than like anything else you've ever seen it's like not anything thing. else i've ever seen but tomb it's, raider resident evil mm, it's ah, that's, that's rough because tomb raider which one the one the so hot just pick one? anyone because this one is not that alicia vikander where she's hot <laughs> this one's not angelina this, this jolie not where eh, meh. i mean back in the day meh. she had the figure for it uh, this had how many okay can you you can probably count how many episodes had clickers two the re three. There was a bloater in one episode. There yes. was a clicker in the second one. In one, and then there was just some infected in a couple others. They honestly in did the not. The first episode, I don't know that there were there were more than one. I don't think there were any. No, I think total there might have been like less than five total scenes. Major infected. Other than like basic clickers or basic like infected. They didn't seem like as big of a challenge as let's say the walking dead, I guess. 
or literally any zombie movie you've ever seen. There's just not a lot of action in it. And I felt like there were scenes that they completely reproduced out of the game, which is fine. And then there were scenes they took some leeway with. Overall, I thought it was okay. I just don't think that the the overall tone was right. I don't think the pacing was right. I think if you binge it, you'd be like, why do these two like each other? I, w I would have to watch it in, in a straight shot to really see, but I thought- Would you watch it again? Yeah, absolutely. I, I will 100% watch it again before season two. And th but then season two is going to crush all the normies. Uh, I, I, th I don't know. I think they're going to change Unless they completely it. change it. I think they're going to change it. They're going to have to because they're not going to squeeze any. But I think they have to if they want to squeeze more blood out of a stone. I, 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 we projected before this even released, that this would be a big hit, which I thought, you know, which it, it was. I thought it was handled well. I just don't think it was gr the greatest thing. Daddy Pedro is bread. pretty adorable. He's all right. I Bella, like Daddy Pedro. Ramsey is just kind of mediocre. It's not great. Uh, the guys who played the, what was his name? Fred and Beans. Fred, uh, Nick Offerman. Fred they were and, great, uh, but I didn't. Yeah. I thought that episode was poorly Frank paced. And Bill. It didn't make a ton of sense. He literally caught a man. I think the yeah gay trap. I no. think if you would have interspliced them into other episodes, it would have made more sense instead of diverting completely. The same with, um. Bella Ramsey's episode with the DLC episode. Yeah, the DLC episode, which was it was just okay. Like, like Joel's was, just sitting there dying, and you're like, let's have an entire flashback. It, it just wasn't that I mean it, it makes it makes sense to a degree, but I you mean, don't need an entire this isn't a DLC. This is something you can intersplice into other parts. I I I, I didn't mind it. I don't think that the DLC episode was much weaker than the other gay episode. Right. Yeah. I like that one. And also it's weird that Neil, Neil Druckmann looks super different in that picture versus what he looks like now. Neil Cuckman. Yes. Retaining the most addictive aspects of its beloved source material while digging deeper into the story of the last of us is binge worthy TV that ranks among the all time greatest video game adaptations. I don't think Joel was Joel. Did you at any point think that Joel was in fact taking care of her or was she taking care of him? I... He doesn't rescue her ever. Kind, uh, Name one time where he saved her from anything. Um. Well, there was the time in Kansas. Nope, she shot the guy. Yep. Uh, then she also stabbed the guy. She no no no. He rescues her at the end when that guy was gonna do the naughty things to her. No, she saved herself, and then yeah, but she then happened to walk after out. Saving herself, he put his hand over her shoulder. Joel's and was like, like, baby girl, baby girl. Here's a jack. He gave her a jacket. I yeah. mean, I wouldn't say that's saving her. Hypothermia is a thing. That's a threat. Mm -hmm. He saved her from that. I mean, he did literally save her at the end, but yeah. Oh, also, um, from uh, when they were in Colorado, the, yeah, they the made university. him look like a jerk. How did he save her there? From a monkey? No, no, no. From those raiders or whatever. He got stabbed in the stomach. And if he had just gotten out of her way, they all they both would have been fine. He was in their way. Eh. I mean... He's not the Joel from the video game. He's no. Not the, no. No. I mean, Pedro... Like, I was... He could have been if they would have let him. He fully pulled it off when he was... What was the point of him, like, you know, the part where he's like, I'm, I'm dying. And then he's like, oh, I'm better. Instantaneously. I I really, I'd have to replay the game, to be honest. I, I think did he, play the game more recent than you. And not, I'm telling you. Not that recently. More we recently than you. We played similarly at the same time, maybe a year apart. You didn't play the DLC the same time I did. What is the deal? The deal. Remember, I had never played the game before, and you were like, "This was for the PS3," and then you oh, should that's, play it okay, on the PS4. Yeah, you played it for PS4. Yes, okay, I played right, it on the PS4. Right, you played it maybe several years after I did. Correct. So I have much more clear recollection of this, but and a different experience because I experienced the DLC as part of the game. The DLC is at the very end, though, right? It is. Yeah. 
Which is kind of out of place, honestly, in terms of the DLC and how it fits. I just don't see how season two works. It will a it's going to be broken up into apparently a couple of seasons. B Neil Cuckman said that it's not going to directly follow the game. Whether ah, it's because they're scared. I don't necessarily know what that means. That means and they're then, scared. And they're then scared. C, just do it. Just pull the bandaid off. And then no, just do it. Not. You think that'll ruin the ratings? I think it'll yeah. cause people to be like, nah, mm. I'm not into this. Exactly. Yeah. And then C, um, shit, what was, what was I going to? I don't know. I was going to say something. Something oh, stupid. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's going to be more infected. He said that the, the first Yeah, season, but if you play the game, there aren't more infected. In the what? In the second game? Uh, there aren't more infected? What are you talking about? Uh... <clears throat> Fair enough. In the in the first game, there's a lot. In uh -huh. the second game, it's mainly people you're murdering. That's my point. Yeah. All right. Now I um shit. I'm gonna need to play both. Yeah, not. So I don't know. What do you think? What do you say down? Let it's us a great know show. down below. It's, it's a not great a great show. show. It's one of the top five HBO shows. Top five. Not even close. Top five. No. Name four Game others. of Thrones seasons one through five. The Wire. Okay. Two. That's two. How, it's how, no, House of Cards is on Netflix. No. Uh, the Sopranos, even though I don't like Sopranos. No. The Sopranos, people would easily tell you. No. But What's the one with the guy who's the comedian who wrote for uh, Jerry Seinfeld? Curb Your Enthusiasm? Curb your, yeah, isn't that an HBO show? Mm. Shameless? That's Showtime. Shameless? Yeah. Is it? Yep. Um, Harley Quinn is better. <laughs> okay. Harley Quinn season one, two. It's not. Harley Quinn season one. Harley Quinn season one. I wasn't half excited really to watch this. I, w I was just like, eh. No, I was excited. It's a B. It was like a B. A minus. B. A minus. Like, a, like an E. Not as good as the game. For sure. No. But very worth watching. It's, it's not a waste of your time, but you're going to be like, eh. It's, not a, it's no Game of Thrones. It's no House of Dragons. House of Dragons is better. And House of Dragons is terribly written. But it's more dynamic and more exciting. Just because it just has fucking dragons. Yeah. This could have had clickers and it didn't. That's that's fair. I, I feel like they didn't know what to do with this, so they're like, let's not have clickers. They didn't it. want it to be as. Remember, they we also covered changed it in the, the story? whole dynamic of the infected. It's like a World War Z zombie hive mind dynamic as opposed to just singular, you know, enemies, which is what the game was. Yeah, although in theory, uh, fungus do act. Like cordyceps it, do it, act. It like makes that. sense. The largest organism in the entire world is a fungal. Although, column. did you know that um, I didn't? I didn't know this until I heard it. It was uh, the in the last episode. Spoiler alert! Where they're like, "Oh my god, cordyceps <laughs> grow in the brain." It literally grows everywhere but the brain. In real life. Yeah. Yeah, it does not grow in the brain. And then Joel's like, "It grows in the brain." It right? grows in the brain. So, There's a lot of people who are mad about the science of all this. He could have said it grew in her asshole, and it would have been right, but not the brain. Not the brains. So yeah, it was it, it was weird that they were they changed things, but also didn't make it scientifically accurate. Like I don't know. Yeah, it was. It was I, weird. The the whole thing with the El Salvador or, or India or wherever that lady was, that was just like blow it all up, blow everything to pieces. What? You don't remember that scene? Did you not watch the show? Last of Us. Yes, there's a lady from India or something like that. She's like a the world's like leading, or at least that country's most like leading um, scientist in cordyceps, and she like does the autopsy and the things like coming out of the face, and she's like, oh, it's in the it was in a like a wheat factory or something like that. Oh, in the very beginning of the, yeah, the yeah, show, the show that you don't yeah, remember yeah, yeah. watching, the very very beginning. Yeah. I watched the entire sort thing. Sort of remember that. Yeah. Well, not as good as people are saying. It's not the prestige television that it should be. A minus. I still still think the Americans the is better it's, than this. No, it's one of the best shows on TV. In now Daddy TV. Daddy Pedro. A B minus better than the Mandalorian. A minus. Oh, it's better. Well, if you threw Baby Yoda in the Last of Us, though, the last of Baby Yoda, us. Oh my gosh. Mm, I'm in. Again, let us know what you think, because I'm not on board, but he is. Catch our full-length live 
Audio Podcasts, Stitcher, Spotify, iTunes, all those places and more. Support us. We appreciate it. We love the fact that you're listening now. We love all y'all. <coughs> Catch us on Rumble as well. But we are on to the next one. Thank you.